welcome back to my channel okay so tonight uh, we're gonna pour under this canvas and uh, got some bright colors here and I'm gonna use this is actually cut off the bottom of a bottle Pepsi bottle get these little ridges and we're gonna pour our pillow paint and then we're gonna pour the different colors over that and then spin it out when we're done so I think it's gonna turn out really pretty I've seen several of these done. Uh, the one I wanted to do, I didn't realize until just now that I'm out of paper towels. But I was going to do one that's kind of a bloom. And you cover it with a paper towel and then you pick the corners up and the sides and you lift it up and it looks like a flower. But realized last minute, I'm out of paper towels and did not know. So, I'm going to flood my canvas right quick here. I'll put you on a quick pause. My base coat's going to be black. I'm going to try something different here and I'll tell you about it when I come back. Okay, I'm back. Got my canvas flooded here. Now I'm going to put my little bottom of my pop bottle here. Right about in the center. That's pretty good right there. Alright, and my colors that I've got tonight. I've got a little bit of yellow here. I probably should have mixed up a little bit more. Um, I've got orange. I've got a mixture of about three different kinds of blue. I have a green. I kind of want a red. Let me grab a red here. I have a red. And then I have a little bit of black that has the flow troll on it. All the rest of these paints are mixed strictly with my pouring medium, which is white. Elmer's glue and water. Have it mixed up in a jar here and then I just mix it up. Now I want to put a metallic in here and I got to thinking I'm trying to get creative here and I don't even know if this is going to work or not. It's a little thin but I want it to be kind of thin right at the moment. And it is chameleon powder mixed with my Elmer's glue and my water. Well the Elmer's glue and the water dries clear so you should just see this shimmer of this chameleon powder. I'm hoping this is going to work like I want it to. So, fingers crossed, guys. I think the color I want to start with. I think I'm going to start with my blues here. Shake it up really, really good. And then we're going to start pouring over the top. And if you notice, it runs down the sides like so. Okay, so we got the blue. Leave that lid off for a minute here because I may want to use some more in a minute. Gonna do the yellow, I mean the orange. I'm gonna do a little bit of this chameleon powder. I get the lid off here. I love these little cups, they're so handy, but the lid is so hard to get off and on. Like little, I guess you put sour cream or something in them, or whatever, like a buffet or a banquet or whatever. So I'm just going to pour a little bit of this on because I want to do several layers, and it is really thin. But I just kind of want it to give everything else a shimmer. I don't want it to really color everything. Alright, so we're going to stop there for a minute. Let's see. I think I want to do, I think I want to do the yellow. Well, okay. What are we doing? Let's just pour it on this side. all my yellow here. I have to mix some more of that up. I'm going to use the red. Helps if you open it. Okay. 
And I think we're going to do a little bit more blue. more of the chameleon powder here over the top. So I don't know if this is going to work guys. <laughs> it may just be a hot mess. But it's alright. It's kind of looking alright so far. But we'll see. If it doesn't work, I know it doesn't work. Now I think I can mix the chameleon powder. I've seen people mix the mica powder with gloss varnish so I may try that if this doesn't work all right I think I'm gonna put my black on now Tilt this back just a little bit. Alright. So I'm going to lift this up. Get it out of the way. Pull this down in here. Now, I'm going to take a stick here, and I'm going to try to define some of these petals here. So pull them into the center. Just hanging right here. Try to tilt this back over into the center before we spin it. I don't like this part over here. I kind of want to pour some more black on it and. bit more here and then I've got some in my bottle I'm gonna put on there. Not real happy with this edge right here. I wanted it to be a little farther over like the other one. Okay, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna take this. Now, let's try this. Okay. Now, I'm going to bring this into the center. This one to the center. And this out. And out right here. And then I'm going to do a big loop in the center. Alright, well, 
Here goes the mess. This is so much fun, but it is so messy. So if you do not want to get messy, do not spin. Because it's going to be very messy. Get everything out of my way. Alright. And I'm not even going to spin fast, but I'm spinning. These are going to be unlevel or something here because my paint's all going off that way. We're going to bring it back. Okay. Well, we deconstructed that fire, didn't we? Gotta rig a better way for my spinner. <laughs> for a square canvas. I had attached popsicle sticks on here, but I didn't attach them permanently. Okay, paint everywhere. <laughs> Some people do this in a bathtub, and I can un with like a little doggy bathtub. I can 100% understand why. If you see my table around here, all my little sparkly colors, yeah, that's because everything's going everywhere. All right, let's see what we got here. I'm actually really liking this, guys. It didn't turn out like I was hoping. I was hoping more for a flower design, but I'm really liking it. I do a finger sweat to be here. Really, really liking this part here. I can actually see the chameleon powder in there. It looks like it may work if it doesn't sink. That's going to be the big problem is if the chameleon powder sinks. So, what do you think, guys? Kind of like it like that. I'm going to give it a torch. Pop any air bubbles. I see a couple in here. Very, very pretty. All right, guys, I'm going to bring you down for a close-up. Let's turn on the flash here. So, we'll do it first without the flash. Look at those colors. Very pretty. Uh, 
Okay, let me turn on a flashlight here. I'll turn a flash on and see what we get with the flash on. Pretty. Look at those. All right, guys. Well, I hope you like it. Uh, if you like this video, please give it a like, comment if you'd like to, share it, please. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do so. It would really help my channel. Bye.